The SSS clutch is an automatic freewheel gear type clutch which engages and disengages automatically without the use of any external control system. Whenever the input side of the SSS clutch, displayed here in red, rotates faster than the output side, which is displayed here in green, the SSS clutch will engage automatically. The engagement sequence is initiated through a pull and ratchet mechanism. Whenever the output side of the SSS clutch rotates faster than the input side, the pulls will simply move across the ratchet teeth. However, if the input side begins to rotate faster than the output side, the pulls make contact with the ratchet teeth. These ratchet teeth are located on a helical sliding component which is mounted onto the input side of the SSS clutch. So when the poles come into contact with the ratchet teeth, the helical sliding component moves helically along the input shaft in the same way which a nut will travel along a bolt. SSS gears design the SSS clutch to ensure that every ratchet position has a corresponding set of meshed gear teeth. As the helical sliding component moves axially along the input shaft, the pulls are unloaded completely and the torque of the drive is transmitted solely by the main driving teeth. Disengagement is simply the opposite of engagement. Whenever the output side of the SSS clutch begins to rotate faster than the input side of the SSS clutch, the load will transfer from the driving flanks of the main driving teeth to the non-driving flanks of the main driving teeth. This action disengages the SSS clutch in the same way that a nut will unscrew itself from a bolt when turned anti-clockwise. The advantage of the SSS clutch over its competitors is that all of the load is transmitted through the main driving gear teeth. The pull and ratchet mechanism only shifts the SSS clutch in and out of engagement and does not transmit the driving load.